And I'll tell you what, our next performers uh, became world-renowned even more so than they already were on March 1st when they became the first Canadian choir to sing Shan of Madela at the Winnipeg Jets NHL hockey game. That was March the 1st. It has been viewed millions of times online since then. And the next day, it played in Ukraine on uh, the news networks out there as well. In fact, some of the choir members with relatives in Ukraine uh, said that they got videos back of them watching them singing on television uh, in Ukraine. So just absolutely tremendous. They are the Husli Ukrainian Male Chorus, and they have entertained audiences for some 50 years with a repertoire of liturgical music and traditional folk songs, as well as the patriotic songs of Ukraine and the Kozake, based out of Winnipeg, Manitoba, and under the direction of Tadeusz Birnatsky. The majesty and passion of Husli's four-part male harmonies infuse emotion and power into each and every performance. Now, Husli is named after an ancient Ukrainian musical instrument, similar to a zither, which represents versatility and vitality, for it produces not only music, but a feeling as well, and uh, certainly it is a feeling I think that we will all be privy to very, very shortly when we hear just how powerful this chorus is. It is both a connection to the past and a song to the future, and ladies and gentlemen, they have five CDs and an album LP style for sale uh, near the busker stage, so check it out. Don't take my word for it. Trust your own ears, listen with your head, and emote with your hearts once again under the direction of Tadeusz Birnatsky, the Husli Ukrainian Male Chorus. Bing, 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 bing. 
deal if you took all of them I bet um, but go check it out and thank you guys all the way from Winnipeg Hoosley you crazy 